Continuing coverage tonight of the future of a major highway project in Dane County. The Verona Road project hangs in the balance as lawmakers continue to decide how to pay for the roads in the state. Political reporter Jess Garp explains why business owners are now lobbying the state to finish what they started. Construction has been going on down Verona Road for some time now, and in the interest of getting it finished, some businesses are taking their message down the highway to the Capitol. Deirdre Garten is usually in the halls of a different historic building as the co-owner of Quivy's Grove. She's seen the impacts of the major construction project outside her business started in 2015. And she's ready to see it end. We've had um, certainly a, uh, a reduction in our lunch and dinner business last year. She's delivering a message to the governor. We're delivering a letter from uh, three mayors. Leaders of Verona, Fitchburg and Madison calling any further delays in the project untenable. You can plan for a year, maybe two years of reductions, but to ask businesses to absorb uh, five, God forbid, seven years of construction, that's asking too much. That's the main message of road builders and local leaders calling to just fix it. Politics may be politics, but the roads still need to get fixed. Lawmakers seem to agree on that problem, but they can't agree on a solution. So is that the thing you will commit that those projects will continue in the budget? You won't pass a budget that doesn't continue no. the major project? No, I mean, so it all comes down to the fact if we can find the revenue to keep the projects on track. Garten says if there isn't any certainty, businesses may move out, but she doesn't have that option. We're an historic building. You can't move our building anywhere. So it's very important to us that, uh, that, that there be some finality to to the road construction. It still may be a long road ahead on this issue. The assembly says they are waiting to see a transportation funding proposal out of the Senate. Along Verona Road, Jessica Arp, WISC News 3. And it's not only Verona Road raising concerns at the Capitol today. Local officials came from across the state and are also lobbying to finish work on the I-94 East, West and North, South Corridor.